Okay, I want to do a short little video on my blueberries. Oh, and I could do my lemons as well. So we'll start with the blueberries. I actually have four bushes in three different varieties. Lex, get over here, buddy. This is a Centurion. This was actually the first one I purchased and it was all Charlie Brownish. It was on its last legs. It was on sale. I got it, came home, replanted it, put it in some nice organic soil, not realizing that blueberries need acidic soil. So it leafed out beautifully, but there were no blueberries. Replanted it, um, added some soil acidifier, and this year I got a crop. Not many, but I mean, there was none before. Then we have my pink lemonade blueberries. Look at those. Don't they look so good? I swear I want to hurry up. I want to buy them. I'm like, oh, all right. And we have another pink lemonade. Look how big those berries are. Look at that. Look at that big fat one right there. I don't know why I'm whispering, but I really want to bite that one. And then we have our Brightwell. And this bush is booming so many berries on this little bush so we have the brightwell the pink lemonade another pink lemonade and the centurion so i think i'm sure i'm gonna like the pink blueberries the best which is why i got two so let's also talk about my lemon this is an improved Maya lemon. And this particular bush has many stages. So we have the flower blooms in different stages. Then the, the flowers open up. You have all these small little baby lemons. And then I have my big baby. <laughs> my first lemon I'm going to get. I was so happy. So, I got another lemon that I have been dying for for the last year. It is the pink variegated Eureka also known as the pink lemonade tree look at those leaves they're variegated really nice so yeah i got two of those and these have not started yet blooming but i am really anticipating and i am going to keep everybody updated All right, peace.